The Spirit of Indian Painting, Close Encounters with 101 Great Works, 1100 to 1900. Apologies for the condition of this um, sample copy. It's a review copy being sent by the publisher and it's not in mint condition. It has had an accident. We can only stare in wonder at these rare gems of art by an author, an author who shares his lifetime of experience, knowledge and insight. He's a renowned art historian, B.N. Goswami. He explains the themes and emotions that inspired Indian painters and their values and their influences. The different regional styles. Oh my goodness, look at that. When the lamp, lamp of light is of when the lamp of life is extinguished. An illuminated manuscript, Akbar period. Uh, that's Mughal, so that's 1585 or so. Second part presents nearly a thousand years of art ranging from Jain manuscripts such as rival armies meet across the river. Sarja Raja Siddhen of Mandi, an informal portrait, somewhat, because he's partly dressed, to a much more isolated folio of a priestly figure. This section is called Passion, so I think we can understand where this will go considering how explicit the Karma Sutra is and some of the carvings, of course, Radha and Krishna exchanging roles, a glimpse of the loved one in a portrait. How beautiful these exquisite Persian style miniatures are. And there's the Boa incarnation, Boar, sorry, incarnation of Vishnu. There's hawking, monarchs hunting. And then a gathering of Sufis in the contemplation section, a meditating dervish. It's also courtesans and a yogini. It's a Thames and Hudson, very beautiful, 570 pages, published at £29.95, only £15 through Bibliophile, which is half price, with a 210 colour illustrations. And the title, Spirit of Indian Painting.